Hi there future doctors, I'm a fellow medical student just like you and today we're going to talk about something super important for our journey to becoming licensed doctors in the UK, the Medical Licensing Assessment or MLA. Now don't click away, I know exams can sound scary, but the MLA is actually here to help us and by the end of this video, you'll see why. So grab a cup of tea, relax and let's dive in. Alright, first things first, what exactly is the MLA? The MLA is a brand new assessment that all UK medical students will need to pass as a part of their degree from 2025 onwards. Sounds intense, right? But don't worry, it's designed by the General Medical Council to ensure we all have the core knowledge, skills and behaviours needed for safe medical practice. The MLA has two main parts, the Applied Knowledge Test AKT and the Clinical and Professional Skills Assessment CPSA. The AKT is a multiple choice exam testing our clinical knowledge. The CPSA involves practical scenarios we might encounter in real clinical practice. It's hands on and might be called OSCE or OSLER at your medical school. The MLA isn't just another exam, it's a crucial part of our journey to becoming doctors. It ensures we all are meeting the same high standards. Plus, it replaces the PLAB exam for international graduates creating a unified standard for everyone entering the UK healthcare system. Let's take a moment to reflect. The introduction of the MLA is a landmark moment in medical education in the UK. It's a big change, but it's one that's designed to support us and ensure that we're prepared for the challenges of medical practice. It's a way to reassure not only ourselves, but also our future patients, employers and colleagues that we're up to the task. You might be wondering how to prepare. The good news is that the MLA will be integrated in our final exams, so our regular studies and clinical rotations will cover the core medical knowledge, skills and behaviours needed. Staying engaged will naturally get us ready. To stay updated, make sure to check the GMC and Medical Schools Council website. They have all the information you need about the MLA, including the content map and exam details. And don't worry, your medical school will guide you through the practical arrangements as you get closer to your final exams. In conclusion, the MLA is our stepping stone to becoming competent and confident doctors. So let's embrace it, prepare well, and take this important step together. Thanks for joining me today. I hope this made the MLA a bit clearer and less daunting. Remember, we're all in this together. Good luck and see you on the wards.